Hello, I'm Jerry Faulkner, President of Volunteer State Community College. I have on the academic regalia that I wear during our December and May commencement ceremonies at the college. Those are special events for me, my favorite part of being a college president. A big part of what makes it special for me is thinking about how great that day is for our graduates. Many are the first in their family to graduate from college. Many have had significant obstacles to overcome to reach this momentous occasion. That day will mark the beginning of a new chapter in their lives and in the lives of their family. I'm asking you to consider how you could help us help students. The Volunteer State College Foundation exists to raise funds to help students fulfill their dreams. We always have more requests for assistance than the Foundation is able to fill. I'm asking you to help us make this special occasion possible for even more students. Let's put more students in caps and gowns and give more families an opportunity to celebrate commencement. Thank you for your help. My name is Lindsay Ray. I am a first assistant at surgical tech in surgery at Vanderbilt Children's Hospital. I have been a surgical tech for almost 20 years. When I decided I wanted to go back to school was when the ReConnect came into play. The ReConnect grant is for adults that don't have an associate's degree or have not finished any sort of college and it gives them money to go back and finish that program. I wasn't eligible because shortly after high school, found out about a program about a college, it was a private college, that offered an associate's degree and also a certificate program. I did really great, I worked really hard. It was a very difficult time. A couple years later, I decided that I wanted to finish and go back and get my RN. Um, when I applied, I was told that the school I went to had closed down and so my transcripts were pretty much non-transferable. And so to have that come up and it not be worth it, to struggle for two years to say, sorry, you know, we can't help you. It was really tough. And I think it was made even more tough when the ReConnect grant came out and I thought, finally, finally, I can go back, I can get my nursing. This is finally my time. And then to have them come back and say, no, you have an associate's degree, so we will not pay for you to continue. So I do have an associate's, but I also do not have an associate's. If I wanted to, to be a nurse, like I had always said that I would eventually, uh, I would have to restart. You know, I thought a long time about putting it off again and just, you know, not doing it. And at the time we were getting um, two of our sons ready to go to college. You know, we've always pushed our boys to be really strong and really courageous and to, if you want something, go get it, you know? No one should tell you that you can't be what you feel in your heart you need to be. And so I think that they turned that back around on me and were like, Mom, you know, you told us all this time that we can have what we want. Why can't you have what you want? My husband and I sat down and we talked about it and we thought, you know, we can do it. We can put some money aside. I can slow down at work. And then I found out about the foundation scholarship and uh, the ambassador program. I'm able to be a student and a mom and I, I'm not so pulled apart like I was before um, because of the foundation money that really, it means everything. It means I get to go back to school and it means that I get to finish that degree. I mean, it's been a long time coming and I've put it off for so many years and never thought that it would be a possibility. It's literally life changing. I mean, it, it allows you to finally go after what you always said that you would be a part of. It allows you to really strive for that goal that you always, you had set for yourself. You know, I've met several people that are donors. Um, we do a lot of dinners and events with these donors and they are so generous and they are so kind and you can tell they're really excited to give back to the community that they're a part of. You could just talk to any number of the people that receive 
the benefit from the foundation and talk to them and realize that it has changed each and every one of their lives. It's bigger than just, you know, here's some money for, for your college. It's here is a benefit to change your life. Here is something that you've always wanted for yourself and you never thought you would get. Here it is. I tell people that are thinking about college, I tell them Vol State is it. You get so much more here because you not only get really good education and you get professors that will meet with you and make sure you understand, draw diagrams to make sure you're getting it, you know, spend the extra time with you. You're also getting a smaller, more intimate feel. You're in smaller classes, you're, and you're in with people that you know, people that are, you know, they live down the street from you. It's nice in that sense that you're not one of many, many, many. You know, you're one of few, and so you really have your community here.